Hello everyone and welcome back to John's Food Review. Today we're going to be trying some Merci. Fine assortment of European chocolates. Um, so I saw these, I think, I can't remember. I think it was in a commercial or something. Um, but they looked good enough. All right, and then right here is how you open it. Of course, it couldn't just open up the first time. No, it's got a, yeah, it's got a rip. Come on. Cigars, sir. All right, so this is how it's laid out. Um, let's see, there, there is creamy chocolate, coffee and cream. That sounds gross. Hazelnut almond, hazelnut cream, marzipan dark cream, dark mousse, praline cream. So, that. Well, that was super duper. All right, got that sorted. So, we're going to try, I think it's on here. This is dark cream. Um, and it comes with, you can break it like that. Um, 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 no, no. I did that because my previous video was talking about Orlin and how I can't stand with that lip smacking sound. <laughs> John, you're an asshole. I know. Well, it definitely it's dark chocolate, I can tell you that. I love dark chocolate. <laughs> you're fucking stupid. <laughs> um No, but I, I really do think like it, it does have such a great flavor to it. You know, it's still got a little bit of sweetness, you know. But it's not too sweet like some other chocolate. It's got that nice little, like, it, it's a strong flavor. That's what I like about it. Like, just a little bit of this can just, like, change something completely. Um. 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 Mm, good. Mm hmm. And I made sure I had a, a um a drink this time. I figured my chocolate milk probably wouldn't be best because it's chocolate and I'm eating chocolate. So I got some uh eggnog. And a ghost. No, it's not a ghost. I'm guessing it's Someone who doesn't want to reveal themselves yet. All right. Which one was that? That was the dark. Which one's this? Uh, dark moose. Dark moose, everyone. Again with you. You ruined my last video. Now you come to ruin this one too. Oh. John, you shouldn't be doing that. Don't worry. He doesn't eat human food. I've never seen a cat who denies. So I, I've tried ice cream, peanut butter, cheese. And he's like, no, I don't want it. So you don't have to worry about him eating chocolate or anything. He doesn't want it. He just, he just sticks to his crappy cat food. Hmm. Definitely lighter. Oh, wow. That is nice. I dare say that is a fine European chocolate. What? What? Why are you always up in my grill? What? 
John, you guys have such a great dynamic together. Yeah. Can I do something for you? Coming over. Oh, you're going to have to come down here because I'm not moving over there. Nom, nom, nom. Hmm. It tastes almost like... Like a dark chocolate ice cream without the ice cream part. Like that same, it tastes like an ice cream flavor. It doesn't taste like regular chocolate. But then again, it's the mousse part because it's very light and fluffy. And, you know. Well, I know the next thing I'm about to devour. Go. Not right now, Bubba. Later. But yeah, dark chocolate, you can't go wrong. Like, it is such a great flavor that you just, it, you can't go wrong with it. So this is hazelnut. Hazelnut almond. Nah. It's like hazelnut spread. I'm not a big fan of hazelnut. Can hate all these fucking nuts. I do like a little added crunch from it, but from the almond. I think I should probably try that coffee one. I don't. I don't like coffee at all. Um, that's not it. What about you, Mr. I'm hiding over in the fucking corner? This is... No. Pralines, no. 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 about this one right here? Marzipan? No. About this one. Oh, there. There we go. Coffee cream. Ugh. Yeah, I don't like coffee at all. I like a fine Cuban cigar. Ugh. It even smells like coffee. I thought the chocolate would be enough to, like, you know. <sighs> no bueno. I don't like it. I don't like it. It tastes more of coffee. Ugh. I still got another piece left. Oh. Ah, no. Oh. oh, so bad. So bad. Ah. Oh. oh my god, that is so bad. I don't know how anyone can enjoy the, the taste of coffee like that. I thought it was going to be something subtle, not like a fucking fucking right uppercut to your fucking jaw. It's so bad. This one, marzipan. 
This one should be good. It doesn't fucking. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's got you can see. Oh wow. Hmm. Oh wow. Wow. This chocolate right here is sending my taste buds on a journey. I feel like my tongue is a vagina and it's just been fucked. <laughs> but it's so subtle and yet it's so good. I don't know. <laughs> Oh, that one's probably the best one. Like, I love dark chocolate, but that, that is good. Good. What's this one? I'm trying, like, each one. But, like, once. There's still plenty in there. Chocolate a la cream. So this should probably be another light, fluffy one. No, I'm not really. I'm still light. And I showed the marzipan one because most of them are just this. Just one hollow, not hollow at all, just single piece of chocolate through. <clears throat> but the other one, you can see it in the middle. Whereas like the one with almonds or hazelnut, it's scattered throughout like regular, you think. Okay. So. Merci. Merci, baby. No. <laughs> okay, so. I thought I was going to enjoy the dark chocolate ones the most. Ah. I thought I was going to enjoy that one, the dark chocolate ones the most. But actually, that marzipan one was probably the best. It it had such such a great flavor. It was just subtle though, and that sometimes with chocolate, that's what you want. <clears throat> you don't want it to just slap you in the face like a fucking you know pimp who who's looking for his money. You know, you just want something subtle. But I I think that marzipan probably had uh, the, the best flavor out of all of them. The cho dark chocolate obviously comes close in suit, and that coffee one's dead fucking last. Like. It is behind flavors that aren't even in here. Like, that shit's fucking nasty. Like, I don't understand how people can enjoy its taste of coffee and stuff. It's just... Again, if it was a subtle flavor, it was just a hint of coffee. But no, it's basically like you took a cup of coffee and just... Into your fucking mouth. Like, if that's the case, just go fucking drink some coffee. <clears throat> That's what I think about that fucking coffee. Um, I mean, for these, they're pretty good. Um, Raylene. Coffee and cream. Rich coffee, coffee flavored dark chocolate. The top of a white chocolate base. What's it say for all of them? Creamy chocolate. Solid chocolate at its smooth, creamy, European best. Hazelnut almond. Delicate pieces of hazelnut and almond and smooth milk chocolate. What's the Dark mousse. Fluffy chocolate mousse wrapped in rich, dark chocolate. Marzipan with its rich almond flavor. Inside smooth dark chocolate. Yeah. That that flavor, that 
like it was eating it was like eating a chocolatey almond cookie like i love the taste of almond cookies you know it's so fucking good praline luscious milk chocolate with a smooth chocolate praline center may also contain egg peanuts and other tree nuts soybean soy but yeah the um that marzipan oh my god that was so good it's like when i bit into it it was like an almond cookie i love almond cookies you know they have such a distinct flavor and you know smell to them but yeah that coffee one that one is fucking nasty and like i said it falls far behind even fucking flavors that don't even exist in this pack you know <clears throat> they should have added a minty one kind of cleanse the palate a little bit um but yeah so that was mercy um i got it it was like dollar general and it was like five dollars or something like that a pretty good price for the amount that you get and the quality the finest European chocolates money can buy. But, yeah, if you see them, pick them up. Just avoid the coffee one, unless you like that shit. Anyway, that's going to do it for me. You guys know the drill. I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.